Hey everybody, welcome to Yearning. This is a indie horror game that was requested by a patron of mine. Yeah, thanks Francis. Thank you for all your support, greatly appreciated. Uh, if you didn't know, I have a Patreon. The link is in the description. Patreon is a monthly subscription service. You can basically help me fund the channel to keep it going because YouTube likes to just fuck me over constantly. <laughs> yeah, uh, so at $1 a month, you get access to my Discord server. We hang out basically all day together, talk shit and play games and stuff. At $5 a month, you get access to my Discord server and your name in my credits. At $10 a month, you get Discord, name and credits, and you can do a patron pick, like this. You can ask me to play games like Yearning. <laughs> then at $25 a month, uh, you get everything that I listed before and two more patron picks, so a total of three. Yeah. Uh, Yearning is a game that was made by Japanese developers, I think? Maybe? Uh... This 2D horror game is set in Edo period of Japan. The girl notices that her older sister has disappeared. The girl will look for her and clues of her. What will the girl find in the end of the story? Cool. Let's check it out. Sounds really weird. Yeah, the YouTube ad rates right now are about, like, one-fifth of what they were, like, of January, ah, 2018. <laughs> I can't see anything. I have never seen dense fog like this. Where am I? Near the village? Yuki? Where is Yuki? She's supposed to be with me, but I must find her. Oh, look at her little feet. Cute. Z to examine. What is this? Small hut, big box. <laughs> Whatever this is, I'm not sure how to open this. There's like a weird fetus thing up there too. What's this for? Hmm. Uh, baby. Okay, I don't know what that is. Hello. Similar to. Oh. Is that a phone going off on somebody's desk or is that a door opening? Once upon a time, the girl lived in a cave. I can't control what she says. The girl lived alone in the dark cave. Oh, okay. See ya. That was a really cool story. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> is that my sister Yuki, or is that me? My face was reflected in a big mirror. The mirror is damaged here and there. Yep, sure is. I can't read any expression from my face. Okay. This is very bizarre. Again, it sounds like a, a cell phone on vibrate mode is just going off on somebody's desk. <laughs> Hello. Do you have another, t another story? The girl wanted a friend. So she left the cave and departed to the village. After a long time and a journey, she finally found the village. Her heart filled with joy. Cool. See ya. He's had a happy ending. We're makeup to... Ew. What is that? I don't know why, but... I feel like I have to stand on that hand.
I don't like those sounds. I'm good on those. Thanks, though. Something is drawn under the dirt, but I can't see what is that. <laughs> what are these red papers? Do these represent human shapes? They could. I can see that, yeah. I was gonna say it looks like a person in a kimono. Kind of like her. Hi, another story? However, as the girl neared to the children, or neared two children, of the village. Children scared and ran away. <laughs> this translation's cute. The girl got confused and grieved. Okay. Oh, you know, it's raining fish and bats and butterflies. Typical. It's fine. Climate change. What are you? Uh, there's a fox statue. There's a big fox and child fox. These resemble me and Yuki. Another story? There was a pond in front of the lost girl. The girl looked into the pond and saw herself for the first time. Oh, is she like a weird monster? She looked almost like... Like what? That's rude. A fox? This is a scarecrow. This is what protects grains from animals, but there's no farm around here. Okay, let's climb in that hand and hear that, that sweet, sweet sound again. Are you my actual sister? Ah! Yuki! Hi, Rin. Do you have come here alone? Yeah. I saw creepy things on the way. Anyway, <laughs> I'm glad to see you. What are you doing? I have been seeing cherry blossoms. <laughs> this is my favorite flower. Okay. I think these are beautiful. Though, these flowers will be scattered soon. Yes. But that is beautiful too. Even if there are blooming, even if, even if the, wait, even if these are blooming only for a short time. I tried to read like it was broken English. It was an actual sentence. <laughs> uh, there, these are living hard. I think it seems like a lifetime of human beings. I think these are beautiful because of... These aren't possible to live forever. Yuki? Thank you, Rin. I have felt like... Wait. I don't want to hear after that. I... Um, <laughs> was I sleeping? I feel like I had a, I had seen a strange dream. This room is so dark, but here is look like Yuki's room. <laughs> Where is Yuki? So I'm still looking for Yuki, huh? She isn't in this room. 
She rarely leaves me alone. Something happened to her? I went to look for her, but there is already dark. <laughs> It'll be night soon. I need a light. Lighting equipment. If I remember correctly, there is a lantern in the storage. Let's go looking for her. Man, that translation is good. Too, uh, too dark to examine. Need lantern. All right. So let's go and get out of here. Got an achievement called First Step. Oh, she didn't have her cute little shoes anymore. Uh. Is this storage? This has nothing to do with the lantern. Wow. <laughs> Excuse me. I've heard this song before. In an indie horror game. Like, maybe in, like, uh, Spookies. Or something. I'm sure it's, like, a royalty-free song. Here's the lantern. I found a lantern. There is something written on the paper. Apparently, it is a memo written by Grandma for Yuki. This is so old. It may have been written when Yuki was a child. To Yuki, you might need a lantern when you are alone. I write how to make fire for you. You need flint, striker, tinder, and touch wood. Uh, these are all in the storage. Make fire from sparks and move the fire to the candle in the lantern. You may think it is difficult, but I'm sure that you can do it. The flint and striker are the ones that have been I've been using for a long time, so tools will also respond to our expectations. I think that's how, that's how it works. All right. Uh, it is said that a soul resides in tools that have been used uh, that have been used cherished for a long time. So if you do your best, you should be able to make a fire at once. Uh, tinder and touchwood in the box. These are tools. Okay, cool. And I think the striker and the flint are right here. Okay. So X is items. Uh, I have all the tools to make fire. Let's do according to the procedure Grandma wrote. I got a light. The sun seems uh, to have completely sunk. Without a light, I can't see anything. Now I can look for Yuki. So it got even darker once I quit the lantern. Because like I could, I could see more without it. <laughs> Uh, there are a straw rain cape and hat. Oh, okay. I don't need those because I'm strong against the cold. What? What is that? I have to hide somewhere. Uh. There we go. I'm leaving. Or did that kill me? I managed to escape. Okay, good. Whatever that is, if I encounter that again, I should hide or escape. I got a light, so let's examine the Yuki's room again. <laughs> Perhaps she may be back. I, I love the translation. It's, it's really charming. With also like, come on, man. <laughs> Yuki is not back. Let's look for inside the house for now. I should look for things that are likely to be clues. I may remember something. If I feel tired, I think I will go back to this room and take a break. Okay, so this is like my safe room. Tablewares are set. Usually. I use these when I do playhouse with Yuki. Nothing is on the plate. We set something on it and played. Alright, so I gotta get... something for the plates. Yuki likes this dressing table. Sometimes Yuki wears makeup to me. Puts makeup on you? That's what you mean? My face is reflected in the mirror. My name is Rin. 
I'm Yuki's little sister. I live together with Yuki and Grandma. I'm always with Yuki, but... Where is she? Uh, there are various clothes in the drawers. My clothes should be somewhere, but... I don't have to change my clothes now. There are a pair of shoes. Now I can walk on the ground? What was... Maybe there's like, ground this way I couldn't walk on. Confused what that meant. Now I can walk on the ground? Books are buried in the wall. Title is... Tale of Master and Servant. It is a title I've never saw. The book is buried in the wall. Title is Tale of Monster and Human. Have we had such a book? Yuki sometimes reads books to me. I like fairy tales. In a fairy tale, wonderful and happy things happen. I wish that things like that actually occur. This seems a part of a book. The different one. It is completely different from you. It exists due to the difference with yourself. Your shadow is the different one. The different one's shadow is you. It never intersects. Shadow? There are things that combine wooden boards. This is a stage of the doll used in doll play. Oh, okay. Uh, we have play with dolls that resembling a family. So you find dolls and bring them back there, I assume? The book is buried in the wall. Title is The Different One. What is the, uh, what is the content of the book? Uh, okay. Uh, can't examine that, apparently. A fish-shaped, uh, stone sticks on the wall. It seems that the fish is heading somewhere. Oh, the kitchen. I'm waiting he uh, here while Yuki is cooking. It is a little boring. It's a spoon. Uh, there is something liquid and powder in the container. Yuki often cooks here. While I'm cooking, wait here. Or wait there. I'll cook fish today. Hmm. I guess you are not interested in fish? Ow, ow. Yuki likes fish. She has a fish-shaped toy. Fascinating. Okay. So I need to find a fish-shaped toy or something? Are these things used for cooking? I have no idea what these are. <laughs> That's how I feel whenever I get asked to cook something. I'm like, huh? What do I do? And what is all this for? I have been trying to get better, though. I'm thinking about taking cooking classes. Just like a hobby. Something for fun. Although this is an entrance, I can't go outside yet. Let's look inside the house first. Okay. Is there anything else? Okay. Let's go. <laughs> I was wondering if there's anything else back here. Nothing. A brazier is placed. A brazier? Brazier? Brazier's bra, right? Brazier. Is it brazier? Uh, I don't like this because I'm afraid of fire. Oh, okay. Grandma's writing instruments are on the desk. Grandma has beautiful handwriting. So she is sometimes asked to write a character. That, that clicking sound it does? Ugh, I hate that. Grandma? Please write. I 
I hate the clicking sound. <laughs> Yuki, ask Grandma for something. These are Grandma's charms. Grandma, you charm me again? <laughs> You're very religious. You are keen on this kind of thing. It is said that if we stroke one's back by paper dolls, they will accept people's bad luck instead. What? I hope you get better. I am fine. Rin is always with me. Yes, I'll protect Yuki. Oh, really? It is dependable. What? Uh... Hi. A paper doll is on the floor. The color of clothes is similar to Grandma's. So I, I bet I can take that to the, to that stage. Okay, nothing there. But I bet I bet I bet I need one of Rin and Yuki as well. Let's go find out. Say, hey everybody, how you doing? What the fuck is up? Not much here. I'm recording this differently again. Whoa! Okay, I'm trying to think of where I could hide. Uh. Is that good enough? Uh, so I use NVIDIA Share, or Shadow Play, whatever it's called. Uh, fuck. But that didn't work out very well. Uh, so how do I get past it if it won't move? Anyways, uh, so before I've been having slight frame rate issues running the program for my webcam and also OBS. So I try to record everything, like, super high quality. And so now I'm running the game on, I'm recording it with the processor and not the graphics card. So I'm using X264 instead of NVENC, whatever. And so far it's running fine. Been holding at a solid 60. And the webcam looks like it's doing good. Hasn't yelled at me yet. A fish shaped stone, okay. Still can't examine that. What the fuck? Oh, it's a hiding spot. Bye. I hate that the splish splash sound it makes. It's so gross. Uh, it seems to be able to use here, but I also need the other. Okay. I'm able to walk on the ground with this. Hold on. Stop it. Shut up. Shut up. Can't use them, okay. So then... Fuck. I guess we have to go to the far left now. Hello? Creepy, slushy, bleh monster? So far, I'm really enjoying this, by the way. It's it's pretty creepy. Firewood, used as fuel on the floor. Okay. Cooking bathing, don't need it though. Okay. 
Uh, there are no clues about Yuki. I don't need to investigate here. There are pickles in the container. Ah, I'm not interested in food. I am. I love pickles. Pickles are delish. There are sickles on the wall. Can I use this to fight the shadow? No. I'm too frightened to fight. That's all right, kid. There's a hoe used for <laughs> used in working on a farm. Uh, this is too big for me to use. All right. It's fine. Let's see. Was there anything? Okay. I think that's it back here. There is a hiding spot under the table, which I should remember. No, stop it. Stop it. I keep, sometimes I hear clicking or something like that over to the side, and I think it's the monster. I'm sure that's what they intended to freak people out. Okay, good. So there's a door. Oh! This is the ground I couldn't walk on. The ground is muddy. It seems the drainage is bad here. The road hasn't been... The road hasn't been difficult to walk before. I'm like spamming the... Examine button on like everything that I walk past. Like every bush I see, I'm like, eh, what is it? Yuki, where is she? Ooh. This door looks creepy. Hi. There's a battle door. I never played such a difficult game, but I like to see Yuki's paintings on the battle door. So is it like badminton? Yuki and Grandma has been sometimes playing with this. I have never played. A kite is hanging on the wall. It can fly put this to the sky, but I am dissatisfied that it isn't decorated. Paint and, uh, paint and glue are on the desk. Yuki often draws pictures here. So she's mad that it's not decorated. The one she just take the paint and do it herself. Or is that like specifically Yuki's job? You can do stuff too, Rin. Check this door out. What? Empty room? There have been no such room in this house. Please protect her. Please protect her. Someday, somewhere, I heard the words. A long time ago. So is the twist going to be that Rin has been dead the whole time? Stains on this wall are an eerie form. It looked like a family. Okay, can't go that way. I love her cute little shoes. Hello. Small figures drawn on the board. I guess this is a child, or a baby, a babu. A person is drawn on the board. This person looks like an adult. Okay, I could go through that little path. Let's go this way first. Check out this dirty little hut. It's a basket to put in clothes. It's empty now. Yuki takes a bath when she is good shape. What? When she is good shape. I don't understand what that means. Cool, thanks for showing me her taking a bath. <laughs> okay. 
I don't like bathing. It is boring to wait for Yuki. Uh, there is something at the bottom of the empty bath. It is a fish toy used for playhouse. I'll take it. So the... Oh! Uh... So the fish toy goes at the playboard thing. Oh, shit. The bath is empty. But why is it making a splish splash sound? I was hoping the shadow would come out. I think that'd be really creepy. There's a toilet just ahead? Maybe Yuki is there? Yeah, maybe she's taking a shit out in the woods. Sure, why not? I would hate to have an outhouse. I would hate it. Absolutely hate it. There's no one here. Okay. The door is closed. Yuki? Are you in there? There's uh, no one in here. Let's look inside the house for now. Oh, there's another doll. Paper doll is on the ground. The color of clothes is similar to mine. Whoa. Yeah, it's hiding the shitter. I hate that, the, the splashing sound. I don't know why. Like, anytime a Silent Hill monster had those sounds too. I always just got like repulsed immediately. Like what is dripping off of it to make those sounds? <laughs> I guess like that's like the first place that my mind would go to. It's just like why is he so gooey? Why is he moist? <laughs> so now we have two dolls and a fish. Do I put all those on the playboard? wasn't there. Were there two sets of those stains before? Woo! Fuck. <laughs> that actually scared me. <laughs> There's a battle door. Okay. Uh... Can't, can't use that there. Can't use that. Okay. See, so yeah, I think I just have to get back to that playboard. Table words are set. So let's put the fish on there. There we go. I totally forgot about that. Yuki likes fish. This is a toy we used to play with the house. Or to play... Wait, this is a toy we played house with? Okay. Whatever it said. Recently, I have a bad physical condition. I have no appetite, and I'm going to sleep for a while. I envy you because y you will not catch a cold. I have never caught a cold. But your skin is rather rough recently. I will take care of your skin. So Yuki was sick? Oh, and when she was feeling better, that's when she would take the baths. Okay. Yuki is basically weak. She rarely goes out, and she always stays with me. Another doll? Yeah, there's the last doll. Paper dolls on the floor. The color of the clothes is similar to Yuki's. So now I can go to the doll room. Now that I have the entire family. Yuki. Yuki! You are thinking only to find her, aren't you? Who are you? It is yourself that you really have to find out. What are you talking about? <laughs> Do you know where Yuki is? 
Why are you in this house? Huh? I... I never thought such a thing. She never thought why she's in her own house? Is this her house? Because we haven't found her room yet. Hmm. Okay, boop. There we go. Adorable. Only the dreadful shadow is in the house now. Yuki, Grandma, where are you? I feel like it was a long time ago that we were together. Yuki, you were a girl, so stop playing with Kite. People will think you are unladylike. That is a boy's play. That's fucking stupid. <laughs> Everyone should be allowed to have fun. Whatever. How do you think, Rin? I like playing with Kite, too. I drew a picture to put on the kite. Hmm. <laughs> You are stubborn. It is not just about kite. Eh. Oh, let's go put this on the kite. There's a picture on the bookshelf. This was drawn by Yuki. A cute sparrow. I'll take it. So the kite was down this way, I think. All right. I haven't seen Homeboy in a while. Is he gonna harass me soon? I'm trying to remember what door the kite was in. Could be in this one coming up. Coming up? There it is. <laughs> uh, nope, this isn't Kite Room. Where was Kite Room? Was this the Kite Room? Yeah, here we go. I'm going to draw a picture on a kite. I think that a picture of a bird is perfect. I like sparrows. Rin, you not know, but by the time our parents were still alive, I was watching sparrows coming in the garden with my family. Maybe better to visit the cemetery soon. Our parents died when Yuki was a child. They died of illness. I don't remember their face. But Yuki said they were kind. Sparrows is one of my... Sparrows is of a precious memory, is think what they said? Uh, between Yuki and her parents. Cemetery. Okay. So now I go back... Outside, to the right. I looked around the house, but Yuki was nowhere. Did she visit the did she visit to the cemetery? The outside is pitch black. Should I ask someone to look for her? However, I'm very anxious <clears throat> to meet people. Other than Yuki by myself. I never want to do so. I'll look for her by myself. Let's go to the entrance. Okay, so I go back to the front door. I believe. Which was this way. Like, a long, long ways. Okay, is this the entrance they're talking about? From here to the cemetery isn't far. I am a little scared, but I will go. Hello. Hey, Rin. 
I've always wondered. Where is the soul before one is born? Upon the sky or under the ground? Does it come from such a place? Or did my father and mother give their soul to me? Genshin called out of the box. I'll arrive at the cemetery. I'll soon arrive at the cemetery. I visited the cemetery many times, but I'm scared now because I'm alone. Yuki, are you in there? Ooh, is that blood? Progress saved. Oh, it's her room again. Why is Yuki's room here? I don't know why, but I feel relieved when I'm in this room. I think I will go back to this room when I'm tired. This is Yuki's dressing table. My face is reflected in the mirror. Do I look like my mother or father? I don't remember a parent's face. To me, only Yuki is a special person. The mirror is damaged here and there. Did I look like this before? Hmm. Alright, uh, pause one second. Stand up and stretch a bit. I try to take breaks every, like, hour or so of recording. Zoo boy, sitting here and talking? Believe it or not. <laughs> actually does kind of take it out of you. At least me. There's another giant fish. Is this a Yuki's toy? <laughs> the shape has warped. Has it? Oh, it has a big smile now. It's the snack that smiles back. This is not a food, but a stone. <laughs> I don't know why, the way I read that. This is not a food, but a stone. <laughs> oh. This plate is broken. It resembles what we used for Playhouse? Oh, yeah. There are stones in the cook... Wait, there are stones in the cooking stove. Why are there? This package. Yugi had something similar to this one. I prepared a lunchbox. A bento? I'm feeling well today, so I will go out. Shall we go together, Rin? Hmm. I'm kind of seeing where this is going. There's something wrapped in bamboo in a bamboo skin. I think that is probably wrapped food? It is tied tightly with the string. If I open it forcibly, it will break the content. Alright, so come back whenever I have scissors or some shit. Stones are piled up and I can't go through. Alright. So let's go find some scissors. Or could I use some glass from this plate? There's no food anywhere. I'm already like trying to guess the the twist. That's a little gray. Oh, uh, we were accosted by a person I dislike here. Hi, Yuki. Hello. Oh, Bran is with you. Could it be that you were scared to come here alone? Yeah, pretty much. As she is, af as she is afraid that she is alone in here, she asked me to follow her. Don't tease me. I'm not afraid of I'm not afraid of ghost. <laughs> I'm always with Rin. Haha, <laughs> I know. But Yuki, you are old enough to to what? Fuck in a cemetery? You created a bad impression on me, but 
the reason was that he teased Yuki? No. After that, he said a very bad thing to Yuki. I can't remember what he said. Uh-oh. This is a small shrine. The door is closed and I can't see the inside. Okay. The stones. I should be careful that it's easy to get lost from here. Okay. It seems that it is a part of a book. Let's read. Let's R-E-E-D. Although the road was blocked, the girl threw a torch and diverted its attention. This is something like a fairy tale? Threw a torch and diverted its attention. Is it like a hint for something later on? I'm just gonna keep going right, right, right. Hello. You know a lot of things about Yuki, Grandma, people in the village. <laughs> it sounds more like an announcer than a ghost. But I wonder if you know about yourself, your own figure, your own place. Who are you? You seem to be different from the other shadows. Do you know something about Yuki? Why are you in that house? You asked that again. The reason that I'm in our house is I, Yuki, and Grandma are a family. Am I wrong? Later. <laughs> Bye. Okay, can't go right this time. Are we in like a trench? What are you? There's a stain on the desk. Something is sticking to the desk. Was something placed? I wonder what it could be. The door isn't open. Well, fuck me. Alright. This is gonna be a long walk back then. left this time. There's butts. When I came with Yuki and Grandma, we took a break here for Grandma. And little, little butt stains. There's a tub of drawing water. I don't want to drink water. Okay. The well is open wide. Only dark water is visible in the inside. I can't go up by myself if I fall in here. I fell from a high place before. I was thinking of a strange thing. I shouldn't look into the well. Huh. Is that a hint that Rin is dead? The soul shrine has a door open. This is a small shrine. The door is only a little open. Will gods hear my wish? I hope I, f I can find Yuki. This is... This is a coffin that rests a corpse. Why the fuck did she open it? It is a black doll? I don't know whether it is dirty or burned, but I don't want to touch it. There's a nearby... There's a blade nearby. When burying a corpse, there is a habit that puts an amulet blade on the chest of the body so that no evil spirits will enter. Is it used one at a time? Or is it used at that time? Okay. It seems to be useful for something. Haha, <laughs> it's a cute little shimmy! This is a coffin. <gasps> the doll is gone. Did people or animals take it? You haven't moved! 
You have not budged. <laughs> the cemetery is opposite direction. All right. So instead of a shadow, it's going to be like a big dancing doll. It's like his little spastic shimmy he did. I hope I can find Yuki. Also, hope I don't fall in the well. I should come. I shouldn't come close to the well. Oh, that was it. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. I found the thing that I dropped. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. So I have the knife again. So yeah, whenever I die, I guess, I just drop whatever I picked up. And then I have to go back to where I died to get it. I thought that the thing would be there again. And I'd have to run away or something like that. Not just walk up and pick it up. So now I'm checking out the left path. If I take that middle path I was at, then that would take me back... What the fuck? That'll take me back towards the... The... Kitchen with the stones in it. That tree is creepy. Listen, Rin. When I passed through here when it was dark, I was surprised by the tree. I thought it was a ghost. You are a coward, then I thought, aren't you? This is nothing if I know what this is. Oh, okay. It looks like a face just by opening three holes. Even if it is just a tree, it is up to us to recognize what it is. It kind of makes sense. Fuck. Alright, let's go right first. The lantern can be used, but I already have a lantern. For now, it, is, it isn't necessary to light this. So I'm going to lose my lantern? Butterflies made of wood are suspended. Butterflies that can't fly. Okay. Oh god, it, it's like right there. Let's see, can I go this way? Nope, okay. In here. Um, let's go ahead and go towards the kitchen. Ugh. That tree is creepy. Yeah, let's go back to the kitchen, cut open that package. Maybe then I'm gonna lose my lantern? Let's see, I don't think I've gone to the far right yet, either. Not a, I can't... I'm not 100% sure. Okay, here's where... I use the knife. I really wish I could just walk a little bit faster. <laughs> okay. This is fried tofu? I don't want to eat this, but I can use this as an offering. What? So there are those little shrines. I wonder my neck popping picked up. I didn't even realize I was doing it until I was too late. <laughs> so there are the little shrines. And there was that one that was slightly open. OK. 
Can't seem to use here. Okay. Um. Then let's let's go to the far right for now. Have I been up here? I have not. Oh, can't read that. But it was huge. I can read this one, it's so small. It is dirty, but something is written on it. Do I need to write these symbols down? Rin. Is this my name? Is this a grave of me? Who did this? I'm not dead and not a ghost. That is for sure. Are you sure? What is this? There's something like a grave. Okay. We're getting all sorts of hints that she is dead. Dead, dead, dead. I mean, that outright says that she is dead. <laughs> Hello. Although there is no field, there is a scarecrow. I have recently seen such a scarecrow. Is this a human hand? No, this is a this is made of wood or something. I'm not sure what this is, but this hand resembles someone's hand. I'm curious about this. I'll take it. I'll take this. Cemetery is in the opposite direction. I'm pretty sure I've heard this song as well. I feel like this is what they used in like Slendy Tubby's one. I miss the days of like Slendy Tubbies. I don't know why. There we go. Where did I see that big dumb hand? Oh, it was to the far, it was the left, 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 right? Yeah, let's do that. No, it was right, right, right. Great, great, great! Uh, yeah, I don't know why, but I wax nostalgic about like the early days, like right as I started my YouTube channel, I guess. Like there were just so many, like just fucking, weird and bizarre and terrifying games I had never even seen before. But now since like I've been doing this for so long, like I kind of like, I don't know. It kind of gets a little bit samey, I guess. Like, uh, I keep reading articles about how Mr. X and Resident Evil 2 was like terrifying. But every time I saw him, it's just kind of like, come on, man, move, go away. <laughs> I don't know. Boop. Yeah, so the hand goes on the Handprint with the dancy doll? I saw strange things. Something rides on the hand. Yeah, it does. Whose hand is this? <laughs> Run, baby girl. So I can't go in there because he's being a fucking butthole. Oh, right. There's a whole different side to the cemetery I never checked out. This is a purification fountain. This is where this there is a shrine with a monk just ahead. Yuki may have stopped there. Okay. Still no tofu for you? Hello. There's a fox statue. I prefer the left statue. Uh, the fox with the child. Oh, and a small offering plate. It is said that the fox is a servant of the god of grain. Many people give an offering to the statue. I think the habit 
that treating things in, I think that the habit that treating things sincerely like this is good. It seems the foxes are pleased. Okay. Okay, so let's give you some tofu. It said the foxes like fried tofu. Sure. I think that it is suitable as an offering. Let's make a wish. I hope I can find Yuki. Eh? There was a noise from the shrine. Okay, let's not go in there yet, though. Okay. Let's go in there now. <laughs> oh, ooh. These are tools used to, to memorial service. I don't know how to use these. Yuki was talking with the monk here. Did you think the tree is a ghost? Yeah, I was so surprised. Everything looks scary if I stay, stay in the cemetery. <laughs> I think so. When we are scared, everything looks horrible. Fear creates a haunting. Yuki, you are a coward. Oh, that, that was a little, that was Rin. I'm not scared. Ha ha. Do you think so? No worry. I'll be always with you. Okay, okay. I'm scared. By the way, do you have anything to offer to the grave? Oh, you're going to the grave of your parents? How about purified flowers? Your parents will be glad. So now I gotta take flowers to my parents' grave? Lock and chain are broken. There are flowers in the shelf. Let's take it as an offering to the grave. Oops. Clue of Yuki is not here. Damn it. I didn't see what that said. I'm sorry. I just kept hitting Z and I was like, stop. Craven, st stop, stop, stop. It sounded like he was like chewing something crunchy. It's a crunchy boy. Okay, so now... Do I walk all the way back to the... That's a really gross sound. That is... That is really gross. Yo, cool. Yeah, because I think the only graveyard I can go to... Well, there's the Ren graveyard. Then there are other ones that... I can't seem to figure out what to do stuff in. But first, let's go to the far right. I have a good feeling about that one. There's the kitchen. Although I haven't heard Crunchy Boy. Okay. Chill. What even is that? Hello? So it's not moving forward. So let's just go check it out. Maybe I can talk to it. Oh. What? So do I... Do I just need... Do I need to dodge the letters coming down at her? 
Okay, so I still have the flowers. So yeah, whenever that thing comes down, I just need to avoid the little curse it's trying to drop on me. Okay. What grave am I trying to put these on? Let's try the let's try the Rin grave. Nope, not there. So where was where was their parents' grave? Oh, so that thing that was blocking me on this path, I think, is gone. Okay, let's... I don't know how I got in there. Yeah, oh, there are the butterflies. Oh, the thing! The thing that I caught in the light back there. Uh, when I lit that one lantern, I got that monster caught in it. And so now I can go to the other... Okay. I see what happened. What's up, parents? This is the grave of parents, but Yuki isn't here either. Since I'm here, I will offer something to the grave. Is there a suitable one in the shrine? Or in your pocket? Rest in peace. I hate that clicking. In this village, people are supposed to be buried. In the cemetery after death. I don't want to be buried in such a place, or such a lonely place. I prefer a more beautiful place. Yuki? Why did- why do you talking about such a thing? <laughs> I shouldn't say such a thing. Hey, Rin. I'm feeling well today, so... Shall we go to the warehouse and play? Uh-oh. Yes, let's go! Is that boy gonna be there? Is he gonna be a fucking butthole? The warehouse. In the village, there is a warehouse shared by people. Sometimes, I played there with Yuki. The warehouse. I have a bad feeling. I feel that something bad happened in the warehouse. Clues of Yuki may be in there. What? Okay. That creepy smiling tree should have moved next to the parent's grave or something. I feel a very ominous feeling. What has happened there? What has happened there? Hi. Hey, Rin. Hi. I've always wondered. Where does the soul go when we die? Up on the sky or under the ground? Does it return to such a place? Or will it completely disappear? Or will it remain somewhere in the world? So a ghost? A ghost, you say? An achievement called Immobility. I have arrived at the warehouse, but I don't know where Yuki is. Anyway, let's look for everywhere. <laughs> let's look for everywhere, she says. Miscellaneous items are placed on the shelf, but no clue is found. Oh, here's her room. Progress saved. Nothing in the Yuki's room again. I feel I was in this room for a long time. Just as long as I had been with Yuki. Okay, let's look at our reflection. My face, my face is reflected in the mirror. It is the same as usual. But my inside is full of anxiety. I used to play with Yuki at the warehouse. But I feel I had been there alone. So long ago. Hi. What do you want? 
This place is important to you. Do you know me? You offered to the grave, but instead you should visit here. Why? Is the warehouse more important than the grave of parents? That's right. Here is your birthplace. What? Oh, she's dead. She's a ghost. Talking about this is where she became a ghost. Huh? A big arm. I've been on such an arm. What is this memory? Did I did I see in a dream? This arm. A hand is similar to the one I found in the cemetery. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? Okay, the stairs going up. Let's explore the bottom floor first. A lot of boxes are lining up. They don't look like these these don't look like these can be opened. Okay. There's a big stain on the wall. I feel pressure. Something is attached to the surface. Can I put something inside of this? Characters are written on the inside. My home. Does anyone live here? The door is tightly closed. Okay. Interesting. So that was a lady door. <laughs> Those are pretty rare these days. Let's see, there's a upstairs again. Does she not want to examine that? That opened while she was walking up to it. Oh my goodness. She's just not saying anything about those. Paper dolls on the floor. He is, he is a doctor in the sanatorium. He treats Yuki when she is sick. I can see the vicinity of the entrance from the hole, uh, from the, from the hole in the floor. Sometime I looked down here with Yuki and saw very bad things. What? Uh, where are those boxes? God. So what does that mean? <laughs> she won't she won't examine them. That's what it means. Oh, it's a that thing that walked by? It was a pair of lungs. And it's coughing. So Yuki had some form of lung shit. And there's a fourth floor, apparently. Doesn't want to examine the vases. Or the vases. The flewers. Okay, so here's some grandma's charms. Here's a katana. She won't examine any of this. Back in there. What kind of instrument is this? Is that a mandolin? Uh, there's a harp. I listened to a performance of Yuki. I recently started composing. I'll make it a song that expresses love. I hope it will remain in people's hearts. I practice playing. great. It isn't complete yet. Really, it was three seconds long. I will play for you if I complete composing. Father, mother, grandma, and Rin. 
I always think about a family when I work. Sorry, I gotta pop my fingers. I'm getting stiff. Paper dolls on the desk. This is a doll of Grandma. I have never been to the warehouse with Grandma, but I had seen Grandma in the warehouse once. When was that? So she had never been. Okay, got it. She had never been to the warehouse with Grandma, but she went, but she saw Grandma at the warehouse one time. Was that whenever she was looking down through the peephole? Also, hello. My charms are gone. Again, she won't look at any of it. And the vases are gone. The flewers on the ground. <laughs> Cool. Let's go ahead and just go up to the fourth floor then. And there's a fifth floor. This is a big fucking warehouse. Z to use stairs? Oh, to go up right there. Okay. Hey, it's a jiggly baby! Jiggle, 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 jiggle. Um. There we go. She won't fucking look at this. What do you want from me? She won't look at that either. It's like all the drawings on the wall, she's just totally ignoring. Okay. God, there's a sixth floor? <laughs> Holy crap. Just won't look at the shrine. Yeah. Okay. Making sure I didn't have to, like, stop so she'd examine it. I basically just, like, hold one direction and spam... Examine. Until she stops. This is a big warehouse. Hi. I can see beautiful scenery from this window. In the daytime. There are cherry blossoms on that hill. I love cherry blossoms. Even if these are blooming only for a short time. These are live hard. I think it seems like a lifetime of human beings. I think these are beautiful because of... These aren't possible to live forever. Which is what she said in the beginning. The outside of the window is completely dark. It is uh, square and black. Cool. Okay, so nothing there. But there might be something... I wonder how many floors there are in this place. Hi. Shadow of Yuki? Shadow of Yuki? Sh okay, Shadow. Whatever. Okay, bye. Oops. What? Weird heads are floating upwards as I walk by? Okay, let's see what's on the far right, then I'll use those stairs. Oh, floaty baby again. Ew, 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 ew. I can walk this way? Oh, I can walk over this stupid baby! The shadow. Does it follow me? Does it move in response to something? Apparently I can't climb over the stupid baby.
Oh, it's the noise. That's what's moving in response to. And I can't make that stop. Oh god, that's such an awful sound. Alright, so... Now I know. Now I know. So I can go back down a few floors. So it looks like this is the top floor, which is good. What up? Uh, was it you? Yeah, here we go. That's all I know that it's the sound that's making it move. I'll just go up here and go to the right. Is that what that meant? Is that supposed to be her pointing? What up? What up, baby? Dev's down there shaking. <laughs> yep. Later, you stupid baby. Uh, there are cracks in the wall. This is part, this is part, this part is likely to come off the wall. It's difficult with bare hands. Okay, I, I can't use dolls on it. Alright, so I'll come back to you. Shit! Okay, so I've missed something that I need to pry that off the wall. Let's, okay, let's cut to me finding that. So she realized that it was the stairs, so I had to walk to the edge and hit, okay. I was just like, I was cr leaning down on my chair so hard, trying not to fall asleep. <laughs> I lost count, or, yeah, like I, I ended the video and restarted it, so I don't know how long I was walking around. Oh, there's another fetus, there's another fetus. I have no idea what this is. Uh, there's a chisel on the desk. It seems to be used for cutting. Okay. Okay. Nope. Okay. So yeah, now I know what to do. So now I go back to the other floor that has the gross baby. Are you still up? Or are you just gone now? Oh, you're gone now. Sweet. So I go to the other floor with the gross baby. Uh, and then pry that patch off the wall. Then that'll give me a something? Who knows? I think that I was walking around in this area for about 30 minutes. If I had to, like, if I had to guess. I think that, I think that puzzle took me about 30 minutes to figure out. Uh, kid, your lantern is fucked. Yeah, all right. There we go. Now your lantern's better. Now it's fucked again. Okay, so the patch was... Was it up here? No. It was downstairs. Hi, baby. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Here we go. There are cracks in the wall. Yep. It seems that I can remove a part of this wall with this. There is space in the wall. This is... I'm 
part of the wall was aged and collapsed. Repair of wall is not over yet. The hole on the wall looks like a secret room. Let's enter together. I entered here with Yuki. With Yuki. In such a narrow space? It's too narrow to enter here for the for two people. Is there another larger hole somewhere? There's a box in the hole. I remember this. But what was this used for? I'm curious about it, so I'll take it. Then there's that space downstairs with the weird eyelashes. Near the, the door. There we go. There's the door downstairs with the weird eyelashes in the slot that said home. Could I put... Could I put the box in there? And also... Ooh. Things are getting stainy. It asked if there's another hole somewhere. Uh... There we go. Box fit fitted perfectly. Oh, this is that image she saw when she thought about the warehouse. The picture is hanging on the wall. In the picture, the picture is unnaturally distorted. This is an eerie. <laughs> Apparently, this is the entrance of the warehouse. Sticky liquid is in two places in the picture. Okay. So let's go examine that front area. Sticky liquid. And there's the rando hand. Oh yeah, let's go ahead and save. I don't get it, what do you want from me? Oh, sticky li- uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. How about this? Yeah, let's stick the figures to them. I had seen this scene. When I looked down from the second floor, I saw the grandma and the doctor were talking. What's wrong, doctor? Do you want to talk without other- what? Do you want to talk without other people? Dot 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 dot. It's hard for me to say, but... When Yuki came to the sanatorium last time, she was coughing up blood. It is evidence that her illness has advanced to a serious stage and she has not much time. Oh my! I didn't tell you- I didn't tell this to her. It is temporary that she seems to be fine now. She'll be difficult to walk soon. She'd better be hospitalized at once. Why would they go to the warehouse? Yuki is... maybe... Uh, something about the sanatorium? Hey, Rin. It is said that God reside in everything. Human, animal, plant, river, ground, sun, moon, sky, ellipses. All of the, all of things. All the things. <laughs> is there a God in me as well? Even if the day to die will come, If I'm with God, I will be not lonely? Is there a God in Rin? New achievement? Uh, truth of virtue. Is Yuki still here? Or... 
there's an uh, anatomical chart. This is a lung. People always need fresh air to live. People can't stop it with their own will. Yep. Okay, I usually go right. First thing, decide to go left. Has my room been at my house? Why can't I remember such a simple thing? This is the Yuki's dressing table. The mirror's getting so busted up. The mirror? Yeah. My face is reflected in the mirror. Even if I find Yuki here, I'm very scared and anxiety, but tears don't come out. What? There we go. I had no idea what happened there. <laughs> Alright, so here's a thing I can hide behind. Here's a heart. Anatomical chart. This is a heart. It is sending blood to the whole body. Sure is. Nothing is drawn on the hanging scroll. There's a pill case on the desk. This is what Yuki used. The lid has been removed and nothing is in. Okay, so I need to find... Why is that keep happening? The door don't open. Oh, don't it? I wonder why the lantern keeps doing that. Anytime I move right, it does it. There's an anatomical chart. This is a bone. <laughs> it supports the human body. I might need to save and restart my game, because I don't think that's supposed to happen. When I came here last time, Yuki was with me. I'm sorry for bringing you to such a place. I can't play with you during the treatment, but please stay with me. Yes. I'm always with you. Yeah, I might need to go back to that save room. Yikes. Yeah, let's go back to the save room really quick. I'm gonna save and restart the game. And hopefully that'll fix the lantern thing. If not, this is gonna be really, really annoying. Okay, so far so good. Restarting it. Fixed it. This is a baby. This is a fetus. Uh, it is a figure that before human is born. Yep. That's how... Yep. Uh, it should have been a doctor's room here. What's up, Doc? Do I have to take that medicine? I hate that. That is a mixture of three bitter materials, but it is effective to delay the progress of the disease. Yes, I know. A large medicine shelf. There's so many drawers. Uh, the drawers have metallic parts. Should I place something here? Cards are placed on the desk. Metallic parts of the shelf and cards look the same size. I'll take it. Is a mortar that mixes medicine. Okay, so what? Uh, the drawer has metallic parts. Perhaps I should put the cards into it. I don't know where to put it. Okay. So let's keep looking. Maybe I'll find a like a, a picture or something like that that shows what order to put the cards in. Uh, a picture is drawn hanging on a scroll is a beautifully blooming flower.
At that time, Yuki looked fine. I'm sorry, I can't do anything! Not at all. You have taken care of me really well. But I am helpless now. The doctor will treat me. You should rest at home. And Rin is always with me. So Rin doesn't exist. Something is stuck to the wall. So it's that picture over <laughs> up <laughs> okay what Yeah, so it's that picture of the the flower that's outside. So I'm just gonna draw this pattern really quick. The breathing in this room sounds like the xenomorph from Aliens when it's like in the vents. Like that. And then there's a circle in the last one? Okay. I wonder if that's a... Let's see. Uh... My game stopped? Like nothing's... Oh, come on, man. Hey, everybody. Uh, so I was playing a little bit more, and the game crashed again. Well, it didn't crash, it just stopped. Like, I couldn't do anything. Uh, and for some reason, OBS crashed at the same time, so I lost that footage. I only did, like, maybe two more rooms. I did this one. Which I'm seeing now. Has a single blood stain on it. So here, uh, so this one, and what's the, okay, so the shriveled one has one blood stain. One blood. Cool. Right? And then this is the... I think it's just called a live, I think. So I need to find the door for it to see how many... Wait, yeah, I do. That's how that works. Okay. I think it's how it's gonna work. So the scroll next to the door. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I'm trying to think of how to verbally explain it. <laughs> uh, so on the inside of the rooms, the flower shows where the drawer is gonna be, or like where you need to put the card. And then the scrolls on the outside, next to the bloodstains, those show you how many bloodstains like, on the card you need to use, I believe. I don't know if the game's going to do it automatically for us, or if I have to do it. That's why I'm writing it all down. A depressed flower. Okay, so that is the one I wrote for Alive. Okay, let's change that to depressed. 
Uh, and it has one, two, three, four, five. Five blood. Okay. And so in these rooms, are all, there was also a little cutscene I'll tell you about. Something is stuck in the wall. Oh, so maybe that one's not depressed. Door don't open. You sure don't. Okay. So. Let's go past him one more time. And let's check these maps and stuff again. Just to be totally positively sure. I've checked all of them. Okay, so alive is one, two, three, four. Okay, has four blood. Cool. Let's go ahead and check the map really quick. Okay, and the dried up, dumbass, shriveled up flower goes there. Okay. And so that's where I'd put the one blood drop card. Okay, so I know how to do it. Let's see if the game will let me do it now. <laughs> really hope it does. Because I didn't think it was going to take this long to record. I thought it was going to be like an hour long game. It's getting close to like two. Okay. Please? Okay, good. I guess those are clues. Uh, there were three papers. Let's put the three correct... Let's put the three cards in the correct position. Okay, so the one blood drop... Starts here. Goes over two. Up one. Over two. Okay. Let's go ahead and do the four blood drop. And that starts at the up and down slash. It goes down three. One, two, three. And over two. Uh-huh. Okay. Last but not least, let's do the depressed flower. One, two, three, four, five. That starts at slash, which is down here. So it goes one, two, huh, 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 There's a sound from the desk. Uh, there are pills on the desk. Looks like Yuki's one. Okay, so now we go to Yuki's room, pop that shit in her little tray, and then that should open her door for us. Yes, yes, yes. Hopefully. I really enjoyed this, though. Thank you again uh, for asking me to play this. Boop. I put pills in the pill case. What up? Oh, she didn't say anything this time. Listen, Rin. Everyone must say farewell to this world someday. Some people suddenly died and can't do it. I think that I am surely lucky that I can do it while I live. I want to be with you forever, but it seems time has come to say goodbye. I could barely go out because I was weak, but I wasn't lonely because you were with me. Thank you, Rin. I have felt like... You are a real sister. So I thought, she was an imaginary friend. She's an imaginary friend that a sick little girl made up. Got an achievement called Dream of Butterfly. Are we not sisters?
Did I come from another home? Where was I from? Who am I? Or did she, is she an actual ghost that befriended Yuki? Hmm. I must look for myself, whatever I am. Oh, so there's more. I thought that that was going to be the ending, the big... You were ever real, you idiot! <laughs> yeah, I thought that was going to be like... The reveal. So I only know where I am right now. Am I back at the house? Or am I still in the sanatorium? No, I'm not the sanatorium anymore. The story is written on the paper. Once upon a time, there was a servant and a master. The servant was faithful to his master and served uh, to preserve his master's life. But the servant could protect his master and the master died. Is this the end? Weird, an eerie story. I heard something, uh, I heard sound that something is torn. Is it Natalie and Brulia? Uh. Did I, hold on, let's go back. Did I miss something in that room? I feel like it's gotten a little bit darker as well. Okay, there's nothing in there. All right. Make sure I'm still recording. I think uh, OBS crashed because uh, I was doing the new way of recording. Maybe, possibly, who knows? Oh yeah, and in those cutscenes, basically said that Yuki was throwing out blood and she only had a few more days to live. And then she asked the doctor, hey, would you do makeup? Would you put makeup on me? Uh, for Rin. And the doctor was like, yeah, sure. Though fish can exist out of water, although it can't swim. Cool story. The book is buried in the wall. Title is Rin. If I wasn't born into, if I wasn't born in this house, who named me? Is blocked with wooden boards. Book is buried in the wall. Title is Monster. What is a monster? The one that people can't understand. The one that different from that different from oneself. What is it said. Title is useless. And she called herself useless. I think. Picture of a battle door. That's right. Uh, something, something pictures to remember what is gone from this world, or to leave one's memories in this world. The picture is stuck on the kite. Picture of a mother holding a baby. A mother? She is. I heard something, uh, I heard this, every time I have to read this, it fucks me up. I heard sound that something is dropped. Paint, make up, my face. So I think it was the wooden boards that were on that one room. Hi. Let's keep exploring down here. I love that texture on the wall. Hello. The shadow holds out something to me. This is very small clothes. 
you are... Okay, so I got some very small clothes. Cute. So was Rin a doll? Was she a toy that Yuki had? That she just like loved so much? Oh shit. I should probably go back and look in that room with the boards. But I, I wanna go out here first. God damn. Okay, never mind. Let's go back. Uh I wasn't expecting the final area to be this big. I didn't even know this was gonna be the final area. <laughs> oh, that sanatorium was the end. Yeah, like I would love to peel some of that off the wall. I don't know why. It just seems like it'd be very satisfying. Or like get like a some kind of scraper. Just like scrape it off. Okay, so not that room. It was. Was it through here? Yeah, okay. After the books. Here we go. Nothing is written in any book. It seems to be part of a book. The different one. It is you. There is a comb on the stage of dolls. Yuki has combed my hair by this comb. Again and again. But was it small like this? So, so now I'm thinking... Is she a doll? How, how would that make sense? Is this what happens to the toys in Toy Story? After their person dies? <laughs> Are they caught in this, like, existential limbo? That little shadow back there is really weird. Also, I keep looking over at my face cam to check out the FPS, make sure that nothing's getting overloaded. I got some sun today. I did some yard work in the morning. This was, like, the first nice day in forever. Let's go to the far left before I go up there. It is said that guardian statues save people from suffering. Will they save me? If not... Nothing is drawn on the board. I had thought this painting is a baby, but perhaps this is... a doll? Say it. Say it. Okay. Small shrine is standing at the entrance. Is God disturbing me? What do you mean disturbing you? Like bothering you? Fuck off, God. I'm busy. <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay, I can go in there. God, this place is huge! <laughs> Did it loop? Progress saved. So check out my reflection. Maybe the image on the mirror is real. And if so, I'm fake. Oh, like her face is cracking and chipped, not the glass in the mirror. I see. I see. Okay, here's... Oh, yep, there's that. Alright, let's... So it did... It, look, it seems like it looped. Or something, because that's the... Fake fish can't swim, or whatever bullshit that was. So let's go back out here. There's a room, or a, a gap in this room. Let's check it out. Then I might have to go back outside and... 
go that other path out there. Okay, yeah, and this is where I read the book, or the story. Okay, so I have been in here. I didn't realize that it's all looped around. If I go to the far right now, it's going to take me outside, right? I'm so confused. <laughs> I, th I think this is the way I need to go. I go in the path out here. Is this the cemetery? It is the cemetery. Oh, we're going to visit our grave. If this is not a grave, what is it? My name is Rin. I'm Yuki's little sister. I am. The picture is pasted. picture is as if I felt the shadows scary, but how did the shadows feel about me? Perhaps shadows are also... I heard something. I heard sound that something is dragged. Is it this way? She said it's a scarecrow that doesn't protect anything. Okay, so something was dragged. Does that mean something in the house has changed? Okay, that didn't move. I'm trying to think of what was in the house that could have been dragged. I also can't think of anything. Because, like, the board's falling off the door. That made sense. Paper tearing. I was... I, I didn't know. Oh, there's another path. Oh! What? Black stains. It seems that something was put here. Uh, there's something written on the paper. Look at yourself. So go get, go get the mirror. I bet it's the mirror and the plate. With the fake fish. I don't want to walk in the mist, okay? I need to go get that mirror. And then the fake plate where we had the, the, the fish. Thought it was two little girls being cute little kids. Playing tea party or some shit. Nope. A sick little girl and her doll. Oh, and that boy that we met in the graveyard. I bet he mentioned that she wasn't real or wasn't... Or that she was a doll or something. I forgot about that little fucker. Anything back there still? Yeah, that thing is. Whatever that is. It's not moving. Let's see. Not that one. I'm starting to slouch again. <laughs> Let me sit back up. Whatever. We're almost there. This room. Where was. No! Ah! I remember where her room was in the house. Might be the next hallway. Hmm. 
inside the comb. And I have some cute little clothes. This is Yuki's dressing table. Eh? Okay. I thought that I'd take the mirror out of her room, but I guess not. So I guess I'm gonna wander around now. Hello. Something's written on the paper. Rin. A girl who lost her sight. A girl who lost sight of herself. You may be able to find yourself if you gaze at the mirror. There's a mirror on the desk. Similar to Yuki's room's one. The mirror is fogging and I can't see myself. Oh. 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 That's a very chunky cough. So I just had to stand still. The mirror is off and the stand is off from the stand and it is cracked. This is not fogging, but it doesn't reflect my face. This mirror is... Again, the lantern. Can't really fix it. Uh, the lantern is what? Pray tell. I'm kind of ashamed to admit how long that took me to figure out. To just stand there. It took me quite a bit. Okay, so I think we go put... Nope. We go put the mirror down on the thing. And I think then it'll send me out to get one more thing. Maybe not. Maybe it won't. Please don't. Okay. Use the mirror. The hairbrush. Oh, and the... Okay. thought that was just a cross. Why would it be a cross? I... I don't know. It's you, girl! It's you! If I remember what I am, I feel like I can find Yuki. It's Will soon. Girl, it's you! You are a doll! This is a doctor's note. Ever since Yuki came to the sanatorium, her condition has been getting worse day by day. I can't make her a cure. I'm so disappointed with myself. Her parents died of illness. Her grandmother gave her things to bring luck to keep away from a severe illness. However, it seems it had no effect. The doll that Yuki has treating Cherish, Yuki had named the doll Rin, has sent to her by her grandmother. Her grandmother hoped the doll would accept Yuki's bad luck instead. However, it seems that the wish doesn't come true. Oh, Grandma. What is this box? Oh, the... Yuki, this is a present for you. So the box that I made... That said home was my box. Okay. Wow! A pretty doll. Because your father and mother 
died. Thanks for reminding me. I made it a... Made it a workshop in the warehouse? Made it at the work... Okay. <laughs> so that you are not lonely. I made this doll similar to you. Please cherish it as little sister. And then she put those, like, charms that suck up bad luck in it. Yes, I treasure her. Her name is... Rin. What do you think? I think it is a good name. I've heard better, but whatever, Rin. Please protect her. Always be with me, Rin. Grandma, please write her name to the box. Mm. And that's the little grave that says Rin. Yuki, you are a girl, so stop playing with Kite. Ah, there we go. People will think you are unladylike. Uh, that is a boy's play. That is nonsense. <laughs> Everyone should be allowed to do fun playing. How do you think, Rin? Mm-hmm. You are stubborn. It is not just about Kite. Though you are an adult, you are always carrying a doll. Don't say a doll. She is my sister. Awkward. Uh... The soul is reside in tools that have been used to cherish. Oh, right, 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 right. While I am cooking... Oh, wait, no, that's, that's not the grandma. While I'm cooking, wait there. I'll cook fish today. I guess you were not interested in fish. It's all making sense now. Recently, I have a bad physical condition. And that's her eating the little wooden fish. I have no appetite, so I'm going to sleep for a while. I envy you because you will not catch a cold. But your skin is rough recently. Oh, I get, I get why she said that now. I'll take care of your skin. I need paint and glue. Oh, Rin is with you. Could it be that you are scared to come here alone? Don't tease me. I'm not afraid of a ghost. I'm always with Rin. Haha, <laughs> I know. Dot 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 dot. But Yuki. You're old enough to stop playing with doll. I think that he says you're old enough, dot dot dot, in the, in the beginning. It's none of your business. Let's go, Rin. Did you thought Tree was a ghost? Yeah, I was so surprised. Everything looks scary if I stay the cemetery. <laughs> I think so. When we are scared, everything looks horrible. Fear creates a haunting. I'm not scared. Haha. -ha. Do you think so? Okay, okay. I'm scared. 
by the way. By the way, what? Uh, the hole in the wall looks like a secret room. Let's enter together. Oh, did she get stuck in there with her doll? Nope. Oh. Or is that where she got his... Got... I don't know. The doctor will treat me. Oh, this is the cutscene you guys didn't see. You should rest at home. And Ren is always with me. Please wear makeup to Rin. Oh, please put makeup on Rin. I feel dull. <laughs> yes, of course. But I'll do your treatment first. It all makes sense now. The Yuka's condition is... I'm sorry, it is very bad. Perhaps she can live only a few days. We should do our fare farewell to her. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Thank you, Rin. I have felt like you are a real sister. Oh no! <laughs> and that's where we woke up, right? In her room, alone. Oh, I'm still playing. Ah, and this is the weird misty world we started in. Cute, 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 cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of making sense. Like the whole intro sequence now is kind of making sense. Interesting. I definitely thought that she was going to be a ghost or haunted or something. Oh, and she got buried under a cherry blossom. No. Cute and and sad. No, stop that. Stop that. Yearning. Cute, 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 cute. I liked it. That was really good. I knew that something was up pretty early on. Like, I knew that our character is probably either dead or is a ghost or something was off. I didn't expect a doll. That's for sure. I didn't expect a doll. Yeah, I thought that was really good. I was into that. Again, she called when the mist has cleared. Oh, and the game just closed. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Guess I'm done. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you again uh, for suggesting this to me. Francis. There we go. I had to go back and look. Because <laughs> I, I have a list of patron picks coming up soon. Uh, so, yeah. If you would like to become a patron, link is down there in the description. You can also become a YouTube member if you click the, I think, just join button down there. Uh, you get access to my Discord server and name in the credits. Um, yeah, if you want to do a patron pick, the only way to do that is become a patron. So thanks again, guys. Really appreciate it. I, 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 I've been saying this a lot recently because I really mean it. 
I could not run this channel without fan funding. So thank you guys so much. Yeah, it means a lot. Cool. All right.